Yo, what's going on guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make this red outfit. So you might have seen me wear this in some of my videos, and I thought I may as well show you how to make it in a whole video. And for this, you do not need any joggers, so most of you should be able to do this. And yeah, as you saw in the title, this is without using a transfer glitch, so instead we are using a cuffs through sleeves glitch, which you can see I have cuffs through this hoodie. Um, we're also going to be using a merge belt glitch. So yeah, that's pretty much it, and I hope you enjoy. If you do, please leave a like down below, as it will help out the video, and also subscribe if you're new, but of course, that's completely up to you. But anyway, shout out to these people on screen now for commenting, hashtag TJRH on my last video. If you would like any of these services, be sure to check out Digizani down below in the description, and you can use code TJRH for 5% off your order. And without further ado, let's get into the video. So to begin with this outfit, you first of all want to come to any clothing store on the map, and you want to head inside and go over to accessories. Then on this, you want to go down to cuffs, and then equip any of the, uh, you can equip any cuffs you want, however, I'm going for the spike gauntlets, and equip it on both arms. So equip it on both of your arms. And after you do this, all you need to do is you want to back out and open up your interaction menu. And once you do this, you want to go down to style. And unfortunately, fully cuffed through sleeves, you do have to uh, pay $100,000 uh, to change your appearance. If you don't want the cuffs, you don't have to actually do this part, but if you do want them, uh, you have to do this. And once you get inside, you want to go down to apparel. So onto this, and then you want to go over on outfits, and you want to go to sporty. And then equip this one, so the vibe. It should have the red hoodie on. And don't worry about the pants, we're going to be changing those afterwards. You should also notice your cuffs have merged through the sleeves. So from here, just back out, hit save and continue. You'll have to re-enter your name, so just keep it the same. Then you will have to take the picture and you'll load it back into online. And once you do, you'll notice you have the cuffs through the hoodie. So all you need to do from here is go to any clothing store. So once you're inside of here, go over to pants, and on this, go down to jeans, so it should be the first one actually. Then on this, you want to go and equip the red splatter fitted jeans. So the red splatter. So equip these. If you don't want to equip these, you can actually equip any red pants you want. So if you want, go down to leather pants and equip the red low crotch leather pants. So it's pretty much up to you for this one. And on top, so you want to go down to designer t-shirts. So it should be down here, designer t-shirts. And you want to equip the black print t-shirt. So you'll actually need to equip this. Um, you need Make sure you do equip this. Otherwise, you cannot merge uh, belt on later. So make sure you have that equipped. Then you want to back out and go over to shoes. Then on shoes, this is up to you for you to equip. So any ones you want, you can equip. So if you want to go on arena wash shoes, then you can equip the white and red light ups. I believe they would look good with the outfit, however, I'm going for the all-white sports shoes. And yes, I know I go for these all the time, but I, I don't know why. They just look decent. And once you have equipped those, you want to head over to gloves. So just over to the accessories menu. Then on this, go on gloves. So I'm going for the white cotton gloves. But yeah, it's up to you. Then after you do this, all you need to do is go to the front counter. And you want to save this in slot number one. So make sure you save it to slot 1. And after you do this, you need to back out and go on outfits. Then you want to go down to the highest cover rules and equip any of the last four. So these should all have a gas mask. And it doesn't matter which one, just any of these. Once you do this, open up your map and you want to go over to the uh, telescope on the pier. So it should be over here on the map. And once you're over here, just do the telescope glitch. So run by the telescope and spam right on the D-pad. Then you'll be standing still. So open up your interaction menu and equip the outfit you just saved in slot 1. So it'll be this one. Then walk away and the gas mask should merge onto it. And then all you need to do from here is go down to the mask store. And over here, get off your uh, vehicle or out of your vehicle. And you want to go on any of the menus. Then save your outfit to slot 1. So overwrite the save. So make sure you save it in slot 1. And 
And once you have done this, open up your pause menu. You want to go to jobs, play jobs, from Rockstar Created versus uh, missions even, and start up a titan of a job. Then you should notice when you load in, you load in with a gas mask, and you'll also have an invisible torso. So if you don't have these, you will have to restart your game and try this part once again, and you should it should work. So yeah, once you, if you do have these, you want to go to the ammunition store in the mission. Then uh, over here, just go inside. And then you want to save your outfit to slot one. So on any of the menus, and make sure you save it in slot one. And then once you do this, open up your phone and quit the job. And when you load in, you want to go back into the ammunition store. And inside of here, go on to outfits. So on the outfits menu. So onto this. And on this, you want to go onto any outfit you have a belt on. So uh, if you have the paramedic belt, use that. That's what I'm using. So if you want to, you can go look up how to get a paramedic outfit with a belt on. And all you need to do is equip that, however I'm going to show you a few examples uh, of what other belts you can equip if you do not have these. So one example is the, uh, these ones, so if you, want to go, if you want to equip these, go on to Diamond Casino Heist. And you will have to equip any of these. It also works with any of the prison outfits, with the belts. Uh, but if you do not have any of these, you can go on air racing suits. And these should be unlocked for everyone, you will have to pay for one though. But um, you can merge any of those belts on to the outfit. If you're going to use an air racing suit, I'd recommend using a red or black belt. Uh, it'll look best with the outfit. But yeah, make sure you have an earpiece full of next bit so you can purchase, purchase this from the gear section in the middle. But you do not want to have it equipped, so make sure you remove it. Then you want to open up your pause menu, go to jobs, play jobs, Rockstar Created versus, and start up Crooked Cop. Then when you do load in, set a clothing to player owned, then invite anyone and start this up. Now when you load into this menu, go down to old outfit and scroll one to the right. And you'll notice your belt should merge onto this outfit. Now all you want to do is ready up. When you load in, you want to open up your interaction menu and you need to equip your earpiece. So make sure you equip the earpiece you just purchased or one you already have. Then after you do so, go to the clothing store in the mission so you spawn closer when you quit the mission. And then over here, make sure you still have your earpiece equipped. Then you want to quit the job by using your phone. Now when you do load in, you want to go over to the clothing store. And inside of here, just go and save your outfit on the front counter. So yeah, feel free to customise this as much as you want to. So feel free to add a rebreather or any helmet. If you do have the red bulletproof helmet, you can do the telescope glitch to add it to this outfit and merge it on. But yeah, that's up to you. Also, if you don't have an invisible torso, uh, or if you just don't like it, you can open up your interaction menu and go to inventory body armor, show armor, and you can show standard armor, and you'll notice your invisible, it'll cover the invisible torso. And now it looks more like a normal outfit with a paramedic belt and some glitched cuffs. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this, that's going to be the video done. Um, feel free to save this as an extra outfit. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like down below, as of course it helps out the video. But that's completely up to you. And yeah, have an amazing day or night, and I'll see you all in the next one.